What's up everyone, this is Movie and Game Lover 98 and today I got a very special Blu-ray from Disc Replay today because I had to help my brother get these two PS2 games that we had stored on the laptop but I don't know what the frick's going on with it. So yeah, I just got the one Blu-ray because I didn't want to have to waste money because I have to also help him. So yep, let's get look at it and I hope you guys like this video. And you just saw it there for a second and you know what it is? So I'm going to pull it up in a sec. Yep, that's right. The movie 17 again on Blu-ray. Yep, starring Zac Efron, of course, because you know we know who he is, who, who was famous for playing Troy Bolton in all three High School Musical movies, and yep, we all know that. So yep, here it is. It looks similar to my single-disc DVD copy because... Well, that one you can choose between widescreen or full screen, but this one I'm definitely sure you can just choose. Well, it's just going to automatically put it in widescreen because that's what Blu-rays are about. And yeah. And also difference is that on the DVD, the logo was shifted upwards, but now it's in the middle, which I like better than just being at the top on other things. Yep. Yep, this is a 2009 Blu-ray because it came out the same time as the DVD. That's back in the olden days when... You know, a lot of the children's shows on VHS, they came out on VHS and DVD at the same time, and that was back in the um, start of the 2000s, but this is when VHS was starting to get rid of in the mid-2000s, late 2006, early 2007. And yeah. Yep, here are the two discs. This is the Blu-ray and digital copy, not Blu-ray and DVD, because I have a Blu-ray player. Yep, they both contain Mike. I'm pretty sure... Well, yeah, played by Zac Efron. It's something I would know. This is the same image from the DVD, and this one has him wearing his cool sunglasses. Because, you know, he... He goes through a teleporter water thing, and he goes backwards through time, and he forces himself to go backwards back to his high school days and find a way to get back to his adulthood and before he gets... Well, he gets divorced and everything. And yep, yep, I am so glad to finally have 17 again on a watchable format, because I don't think this is ever going to get released on 4K. Even though I could have just done it two years ago, because, like I said, 4K Blu-ray came out in probably late 2016, early 2017. Well, I'm pretty sure it was the summer of 2017, because I know the Disney live-action version of Beauty and the Beast came out on 4K in the summer of 2017, and Cars came to, f well, Cars, the the third one, the final one, Cars 3, came to 4K in late 2017. And and we all know Coco came to 4K in the start of 2018. So yeah, the start of 2017 is when they started doing 4K for the some of these older movies. So anyways, yep, I am so happy to finally have 17 again on Blu-ray. And yep, I can watch Mike go doing that funny lightsaber fight with his roommate at full 1080p and we all know how blu-ray picture quality is and all that quality and stuff and even though 4k goes up to even more that like with 21 something p or something so anyways yep i'm so happy to finally have 17 again on blu-ray and you know yeah i'm so happy to finally have it on a easy to watch format well well because you know i wanted to have lots of blu-rays and this is one of them so anyways yep that's really gonna be for this video everyone. Showing off my Blu-ray I got from Disc Replay. That'd be the 2009 comedy with Zac Efron, 17 again. And, yep, stay tuned for another video where I'm going to address something. The bad news, but I'm going to address the good news. On something particularly that I wanted to do for a long time. So, yep, stay tuned for that video addressing what's been going on with the, the bad news. And me addressing some very good news. So, yep, stay tuned for that video coming soon, everyone. And hopefully you guys will get to understand what's been going on lately with that thing.